for the history lesson. That was awesome. And uh, so glad that uh, Jackie Bos Bosco was here. It's great to see you, Jackie. A um, couple things I just wanted to talk about. Um, I've been paying attention to the tax assessor issue because uh, nonprofits, farms, and residents have been greatly affected. Um, the purpose of the Board of Assessment Appeals is to offer some relief to taxpayers. And the board is governed by the Connecticut, by Connecticut State Statute, which clearly states that the town tax assessment office is not supposed to interfere. Um, this year's Board of Assessment Appeals proceedings were more numerous and complicated because there was a revaluation of properties and because nonprofits and farms were notified that they were losing their status. This helps no one. When, when I give money to nonprofit organizations, I don't expect the money to be paid to the town for taxes. As far as farms, traditionally communities expect their food, food grown to be taxed at a lower rate. The, uh, the farms are not making a lot of money, but they are growing much needed food. And this is not a political issue. This is a let's do the right thing for Enfield issue. Um, the minutes of the proceedings, uh, very detailed, uh, were voted on and posted as law requires. Um, I did take a look at them, and then when I went back to reference, I noticed that they had disappeared from the website, which is, um, I'm here to say, I just, I just want to know why. I mean, it, it doesn't seem, I don't believe that, um, that state, the state statute allows you to do that. So if you don't know why, can you please find out? Um, the second issue that I'm here for is the, um, the Republicans lost a giant two months ago. Councilor Joey Bosco was a huge loss to his family, friends, and the town in general. It was difficult to even consider putting someone to take his spot. I, I struggled. But I knew Joey very well, and he would expect us to fill the vacancy. The Enfield Republicans, according to the bylaws, did, a, did just that approximately six weeks ago. Our endorsed candidate is a good man, someone that uh, Joey knew very well also, and we know that he'll do his best for Enfield. I'm so happy to see it on the agenda today. And what I'm asking you respectfully, I mean, I'm asking you to vote for, for Jim Nasuda, to vote yes for him. And um, because it, District 1 deserves their, their representation back. So I'm asking you that. Thank you very much. Thank you, Kelly. Anyone else?